What is the sacrifice all about? Think. Allah instructed Ibrahim alayhi salam to do something. He said, Sami'na wa ata'na. I've done it. And subhanallah, here goes. Allah says, you deserve a day of Eid and everyone's going to have to follow suit. But what about us when Allah told us to do something? We're doing the opposite and we're saying Eid Mubarak. I'm so happy we have this Eid. We have this Eid. By the way, some of you are saying that Eid is on a Saturday. No problem. For those whose Eid is on Saturday, we're, we're happy for you as well, mashallah. But this message is, do you know Allah says, When you turn away, Allah replaces you with others who will not be like you. So when a person obeys Allah's instruction, they deserve this Eid. It is the Eid of sacrifice. Have you sacrificed something? Allah instructed you to do something and you did it. Whether you liked it or not, whether it made sense to you or not, then you deserve this Eid. That's what this Eid is all about. The Eid of submission, the Eid of obedience, the Eid of doing that, whether it made sense to you or it didn't make sense to you. Here is the Eid, subhanAllah. So Ibrahim alayhi salam was told to sacrifice his son. Did it make sense to him? No, zero sense. But what happened, he knew it was from Allah and Allah would never instruct him to do something detrimental for him. There must be something powerful about this. So what did he do? Subhanallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, as he was going to obey our instruction, we replaced his son with a ram and we made it a sunnah. We became pleased with him. And that is the day of Eid. It's called Yawm al-Nahr, the day of spilling. Subhanallah, the, you know, the sacrificial animal's blood. And subhanallah, for you and I, what's more important is the sacrifice. What are you prepared when Allah told you, do your salah? Are you ready to sacrifice your bed? Are you going to put this the, the knife on the bed to make sure i'm up for fajr if that's the case you deserve this eid it's the eid for sacrifice when allah told you to dress in a specific way have you dressed that way even if maybe it might have been shaitan might have tried to beautify the other way for you but you knew that's the beautification of shaitan this is the beautification of allah i need to do this let me do this is that what you have done if you have obeyed allah at a time when it was so difficult that is when you can say eid mubarak and enjoy the eid and this day of the sacrifice What's the point of sacrificing? And this is the reason why some people say we're not going to sacrifice. I've got a cabbage in my garden and I'm going to give that cabbage because, you know, I don't believe in this sacrifice. Subhanallah, you've, you 